right now. The Catholic Diocese of Baton Rouge is ready to welcome its new bishop. Yeah, there are several events before Michael Duca officially takes on his new role tomorrow. Local 33's T.C. Mazinga joins us live from St. George Catholic Church with a preview of the happenings out there. T.C. Good evening, John and Dion. We are just less than 24, 24 hours away from Bishop Duca becoming the official Bishop of Baton Rouge. Before all of that, he's set to do a meet and greet, which is happening right here, right behind me. Not only is he doing a meet and greet with members of the community, he's also meeting local officials as well. But he's going to be into another community that's going to be very welcoming of him, and he's going to make every effort to meet as many people as he can, and not just Catholics, because uh, although we have 200,000 Catholics in this uh, diocese, uh, there are a lot of other people who are very, very uh, interested in meeting our new bishop. So tonight he'll meet some of the civic and civil officials. He'll also meet ecumenical officials. Now, following the meeting, there will be the following the meet and greet. There will be a prayer that's happening at 7 p.m., and then there will be a reception. And then tomorrow's the big day. His installation will be happening at the St. Joseph Cathedral uh, on Main Street. This is happening at 2 p.m. tomorrow. So that's it for me. We are live here at the St. George Catholic Church. I'm T.C. Mazinga for Local 33 News.